Hi, Michael Miller here. Today we're going to talk about how to build a fire. Let's start with the assumption that we have some matches, otherwise this is going to be a pretty long video. All right, the three key steps, three key pieces are tinder, kindling, and fuel. So we're going to start with a little bit of tinder. Now we're going to start this without a fire starter this time and just show you some of the basics. So I'm going to use some birch bark here, some dry birch bark. I'm just going to rumple that up. This is this along with the tinder here. Tinder is little stuff like about the size of a pencil. Nice dry tinder. I'm going to put that on top of there and I'll just light this birch bark with the match. All right, now that that's going, we're just going to place the tinder on top of it. Give it some nice airflow. This is the fuel. I like to put that alongside right at the very beginning of the fire so that we have a little bridge for our kindling. I'll put a little more tinder on there. Now, if you're building without a fire starter. Sometimes birch bark can be a little bit smoky at first. That's just the natural way of birch bark. But I, I really like birch bark because you, as you can see it's easy to start, throws a pretty good flame and gets things going. Now for the kindling. Kindling is about the size of a finger or a thumb. We're going to get the kindling on top of there. I'm gonna, I like to cross hatch that just like that across the fuel source and then I'll do a little bit more fuel. There you go. There's your first fire. Good airflow, nice flame. Don't overload it with too much wood or you're going to smother the fire. We've got ourselves a fire. Go get a beer. If you like this video, click subscribe. And join us next time for how to build a fire using a fire starter. It's even easier than this.